to my kitchen. This is where us legionaries gather more than three times a day, actually, to, uh, to feast on the food that has been provided for us by God's, God's goodness. Today is Sunday, 28th Sunday at Ordinary Time, and today's gospel is about the invitation to the wedding feast. And one of the big lessons from that gospel is the enemy. There is an enemy, and that enemy is called distraction. We are perpetually inundated by distraction, stimuli. They're just taking, taking our minds and our hearts and just scattering them to all directions. And I want to help give some little advice about how to, to help correct that, and as well to bring in a point that Pope Francis just brought in recently, which I have on my computer here. He talks about the devil, and the devil is very active in our lives, but what he tries to do, he tries to do is to, to create a, a seduction, that he brings a spell upon us, and that spell is through distractions, and then the spirit of worldliness starts to come in, and this worldliness creates an amazing amount of emptiness in our lives and therefore then we try to fill this emptiness with junk and it leaves us completely and utterly just separated you know <laughs> you ever had that feeling well believe it or not this is a lesson of separateness and of bringing it home i'm going to i'm going to bring it home here now the the lesson now if you take a look at this peanut butter let's see if i can open it up here this peanut butter is natural, as you saw, natural. And just take a look at that. And see how the oil is separated from the peanut butter. And it is amazing how our lives are like that. Our soul and our body, are just, they're just completely separate. We, we are looking for ways to bring peace to our hearts and our minds. Now, the only way to bring peace is going to be through this. <laughs> Prayer, the drill of prayer. And prayer makes it all come together, brings us into one. So I'm going to demonstrate, and I hope I don't have a lot of problems doing this. All right, so let me reverse this here. So watch this. This is prayer. This is our just messed up, divided life. And watch what happens. When we pray, I'm not going to spill this all over my cassock, believe me. Believe me. Take a look at that. Sometimes you got to start slowly your prayer. Sometimes you just got to, you know, take it easy. And before you know it, you're getting deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper. And, deeper. and you got to hold on because otherwise it's going to spin out of control. All of a sudden, your life is starting to come together. It's starting to get flavor. You got to get deep in there. Deep. Then. That's what prayer does. It brings it all together. Your circumstances of life. All your trials and difficulties, prayer transforms that and makes us whole. And when we're whole, we have peace. Now I'm going to enjoy a peanut butter sandwich. May God bless you and may you always have peace of heart. See you later. Bye-bye.